here this is question 96 calculate trade payable turnover ratio for the year 2015-16 in each of the following cases here answer 96 case 1 read the question and see this case 1 trade payables or creditors turnover ratio is equal to net credit purchases upon average accounts payable that is equal to net purchases minus cash purchases we will have this net credit purchases and here in this question we have been given only one item of a closing trade payables 45,000 rupees that is only closing trade payables this will not be averaged because only one part is given that is rupees 360,000 minus 90,000 whole divided by 45,000 that is equal to rupees 2,70,000 upon 45,000 that is equal to 6 times this part 1 is over now part 2 case 2 this is opening trade payables rupees 15,000 closing trade payables rupees 45,000 net purchases rupees 3,60,000 here trade payables or creditors turnover ratio or trade payables turnover ratio that is net credit purchases upon average accounts payable that is equal to net purchase because no cash purchase or credit purchase is not given hence net purchase will be treated and termed as credit purchases and for average accounts payable we have to add opening trade payables plus closing trade payables whole divided by 2 that is equal to rupees 360,000 whole divided by rupees 15,000 plus rupees 45,000 whole divided by 2 that is equal to rupees 360,000 upon rupees 30,000 that is equal to 12 times and in case of case 3 that is closing trade payables rupees 45,000 net purchases 3,60,000 that is trade payables or creditors turnover ratio is equal to net credit purchases upon average accounts payable that is net purchases upon closing trade payables that is rupees 360,000 upon rupees 45,000 as the amounts are directly given to us and that is 8 times here net credit purchases is net purchases and closing trade payable is only one item is given hence it will not be averaged and the answer will be 8 times then the last case case 4 trade payables or creditors turnover ratio is equal to net credit purchases upon average accounts payable now the detailed analysis of the formula net credit purchases upon closing trade payables minus creditors for supplier of machinery because here trade payables means we have to take only credit creditors for supply of goods here one creditor who has supplied a machinery worth rupees 55,000 has been included in this normal creditors normal creditors are the suppliers of goods and services who is the firm is trading in hence these creditors for supplier of machinery will be taken out to find out closing trade payables that is rupees 360000 whole divided by rupees 55000 minus creditors for supplier of supply of machinery rupees 25000 will be taken out then it will be 12 times and this is the final answer